What's up, folks? It's Duke here from GeoFolks. Today we're going to talk about labeling. So say we want to remove Queen Street while keeping other labels. We can go over to our feature class. We can right-click it. We can go to Labeling Properties. Go up top to SQL or SQL. Hit New Expression. And now we can search for the name that's displayed within a label, the name of the field. Um, we can select Is Not Equal To. And then select the name that we want to not display. So in this case, Queen Street. Once we have that in, we can click apply at the bottom. After we click apply, we can see that the Queen Street label is not displayed anymore. If you prefer to work with the SQL expression itself, over to the top right, there's a toggle switch next to SQL. You can hit that. And then you'll see the actual SQL expression itself. I find this useful when you need to make a larger expression. Instead of dealing with the graphical user interface or GUI, you can use this copy and paste your own expression that you were able to type in as we did here. So in this expression, I expanded upon the last one in which I want other streets to be eliminated as well. So Mississippi Avenue and Florida, as well as Queen Street, not to display within the label. So once you have that in, you can click apply. And there you have it. Those streets are also eliminated from the display of the label. If you don't like working with the expression itself, you can hit that toggle switch again, and it brings you back to the GUI. There you can expand again, or either remove particular parts of the expression. By clicking the red X next to each particular clause. If you want to remove the entire expression, you can go to the top and hit removed. Then you can click apply. I hope this tutorial helps with manipulating the display of labels within ArcGIS Pro. Thank you.